Hi guys, welcome back to CRD. Today I came with one tutorial on Flask and here I will show you how can you make file drag and drop system in your Flask website. Okay, suppose I have here my website and I have made a system here for file dragging and dropping system for uploading the files. So here it is written that drop files here or click to upload. When I will click to upload and then I can upload any of the file okay I can upload any of the file let me come to any picture and open it then it will be uploaded here okay and all the details will be shown here and now suppose I have to drag and drop then I will come to any folder okay suppose this is my folder and under this I have app.py file and I am uploading this so it will be uploaded here okay now suppose I have here templates and under templates I have index.html file let me show you first okay here it is and now it will be uploaded when I will drag here okay so it is now being uploaded okay and all the uploads will be in the folder where you will go through that okay so all the things are being uploaded here so now let me show you how can you make that so guys let's get started with making our app so i have some basic things in my app.py file such that i have started the flask app here and called this here and debug is true and also getting the base directory under this variable base dir so let's get started with making our app so first of all we'll have to import our flask drop zone okay so i will provide the code for flash drop zone you can get from my blog or also from description box of this video so i will import from flask drop zone drop zone i'll import drop zone okay this is the class under flash drop zone folder in it file so it will be now uploaded here and now i'll have to config some things from drop flash drop zone to my app okay so i'll call here app dot config dot update okay and under this i will make some variables and make the instance of that so first of all i'll use uploaded underscore path okay and this will be the path for the uploading files to be saved so i'll use here os dot path dot join and i will join base dir with another folder okay and i am using here another folder and that will be called uploads so all the files will be uploaded in base dir uploads folder okay so now uploaded path variable is called and now let me make another variable and that will be the maximum file size for our drop zone system okay so i will use here drop zone underscore file sorry max file i'll use here max underscore file underscore size okay and this will be the maximum file size to be uploaded okay and i'm using here 1024 that means 1024 mbs that means one zb file can be uploaded here okay you can increase or decrease these things okay now uh, also i will make here drop zone timeout okay that means under this time your file must be uploaded if not then it will be discarded okay so i'll make it as uh, suppose five minutes i'm giving five minutes so i will call here five into 60 seconds okay that means it will be five and i'll also multiply into 
thousand. Okay, so now it will be five minute. Okay, so all the things are completed here for configuring our app with the update. And now time to make the object of drop zone class. So I'll call here drop zone equal to drop zone and I will pass here my app. Okay, the instance of flask. So now it will be passed here. And now time to root. Okay, I have to make the root. Okay, and uh, my first root will be here app dot route and under the route i am passing this okay that means on the home page our app will be shown for the uploading okay if, if you are making any app and then you want that you want these things in upload or anything then you can pass that thing as the route okay and now here i will pass the methods and my methods will be both things post and also gate okay so let me close this and now under this route uh, let's make a method called upload okay and under this upload i'll just call that if request dot method if request dot method will be will be post okay if that thing will be here then i will get the files from the request okay request dot files dot get okay all the files will be here and let me pass here file okay so a variable will get the files being uploaded and now app dot save will be called here it will be saved on os dot path dot join and here i will call app dot config and under the configuration we have already passed uploaded path okay so i will use here this thing uploaded path okay so i will use here like this uploaded path okay and under this sorry this will be uh like this app.config uploaded path and here i'll also pass the file name okay so f dot file name will be called so that the file name of the f will be passed here and now our file have been saved so use the random template to get our html file okay so i will use here return render template okay and i will pass here one html file and my default html file is index.html so i have passed here index.html okay so all the things have happened here and now time to create our index.html file i have already created index.html and this is very simple i have just used the title here and loaded the css of drop zone and style i have made here that is very simple and it is made already by the default developers of flash drop zone and now i have used here a div and this will show just a message that file drag and drop system with flash drop zone okay and now all the things just which are imported are these three lines okay so here create method for drop zone is called and action is upload and now js is uploaded here and configuration of the drop zone is done here now we have done all the things so let me check again my app.py file so that i can identify the errors here and uh, okay uh, let me check that 
this parenthesis is not closed here so let me close this parenthesis here and also uh, uh, here I have missed this comma and now uh, one mistake is now here also that it is not in correct indent so let me do it in correct indent and let me save and now run this so open my terminal here I am using here git bash if you have cmd terminal then you can do the same with that and I will call here python app.py file and now it will be run here so finally it is running and now let me go to my browser here and under this let me refresh this and now it has come here that file drag and drop system is now here and drop files or click to upload so let me come here and now I have one folder here and suppose I have to upload some music okay so I'll come under this okay and now I have to upload all of these five files so I'll drag all these five files and these all are being uploaded okay as you can see all the things are working fine and I'll show you that all these files will be in our uploads folder okay so let me check in my uploads folder and you will see that all these music items are coming out here okay so guys we have done I hope guys you have enjoyed this tutorial if you have enjoyed then please do subscribe guys you are not subscribing the channel but you are only watching the videos if you want another videos like this so you will have to subscribe the channel and also press the bell icon and also guys don't forget to share to your friends thanks for watching